Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you are new here thank you for joining me I'm Katie and just for a bit of fun I'm going to open an advent calendar and draw something based on the contents so I've got these strange mochi figurines and they're, oh, they're, right. they're very gross to hold to be honest but let's see what we can do so door number one's got a penguin behind it and I've decided to use the Stuart Semple powder paints because why not? I've had them for a little while now, I've not really done anything with them I've got a plan for them but I've not really got round to executing it so I thought well let's give these guys a little spin for this painting and I've just kept it a bit basic because I'm, not, I'm just kind of warming up with this challenge Is it a challenge? I don't know. It's a bit more fun more than anything. But I thought since if we wanted a countdown to Christmas or the holidays, this would be quite a fun way to do it. I'm still going to try and do my regular stuff as well. But this is just a bit of fun. Just a bit of fun. So these powder paints are a bit weird. Now I mix them with an acrylic matte medium as suggested. And they're, they're a bit trans translucent to be honest, which surprised me. I didn't want to just use water, I wanted them to stick to that card, so the, the matte medium went in there, but I didn't use a great deal. And it's dead weird, they, they were they were quite translucent, so I added a touch of white, titanium white, just to make them a little bit more opaque, and that seems to have done the job. So I thought I'd do this, like I say, just for a bit of fun. Open each door, every day on the lead up to Christmas. I'm not really doing an intense job like I did with Inktober so there might be one or two days where I'm catching up and maybe one or two days where I post something else or nothing at all because it's a busy time of year so you'll have to bear with me but I do plan on doing all 24 doors and drawing whatever is based on the inside of them. I'm quite happy with this little penguin the little figure even though it is gross to touch it does feel like the Japanese candy mochi I hope I'm saying that correctly um, I'm not going to taste it though because it is not a mochi so to outline this little guy I use more Stuart Semple stuff I use the matte black and to be fair that's quite a nice paint to use it's quite a smooth application it goes on quite nicely and yeah, I quite liked it. However, I got a load of it on my finger and it ended up going on the chest on the penguin. But, you yeah, know, we live and we learn. I did try and rectify it. But, yeah, I thought I'd stick with the cuteness of this character and just have him, have him facing head on. By the way, I recently hit 200 subs and I can't say thank you enough. Honestly, it really means the world to me that you just enjoy watching this. I enjoy making these videos. I kind of think, well, I'm going to paint something anyway. I might as well film it and talk you guys through it. And you know what? It, it means so much that you enjoy it. It really does. And it's a nice little milestone. I just set this channel up for fun more than anything. And I can't believe how much everyone's enjoying it. So a massive thank you to you all, honestly. I, that's just... What a lovely way to see December in, right? Anyway, let's get back to the painting. So just to add a bit more texture to the background because that pink was looking a bit too flat for my liking and seeing as there's not much detail on the character, I just thought I'd add a nice swirly pattern in the background with the matte black. And to be fair, I've only got version 2, I haven't got version 3 because that kind of came out the week after the version Two arrived at home so we're stuck with version 2 for a while but I'm gonna tell you now that is dark anyway I hope you like this little challenge just a bit of fun if you want to join in as well and draw whatever it is I've pulled out of this strange little calendar then by all means go for it uh, I'll add my social media into the description and then if you want to tag me in it I can have a look and go you probably did a better job than me <laughs> anyway it's just a bit of fun just want to say thank you for watching thank you everyone who subbed and got me to 200 that is so cool 
If you haven't, click that sub button and let's see how far we can get this. Just want to say thank you for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow with whatever is behind door number two. Bye!